Hello everyone. I am Sonali Kanode, Assistant Professor of Computer Engineering Department of All India Shri Shivaji Memorial Society, Institute of Information Technology, Pune. Today we are discussing about the pointer in C. So in, uh, in that video, we are discussing about what is pointer, then definition of that pointer, address operator and pointer variable. So what is pointer? Pointer is the variable which stores the address of the another address of another variable or the pointer in C, uh, C language refers to the variable that hold the address of different variables of similar data types. The pointer performs the uh, function uh, of sort, uh, so storing the address of other variable in the program. This variable could be um, of any type, character, integer, uh, function, array or other pointers. Let us uh, look at an example where we define a pointer storing in integers address in a uh, program. For example, x, uh, int x is equal to 10 and int star of star p equals to address of x. So here the variable p uh, is of pointer type and it is, uh, it is pointing towards the address of the x variable which is of the integer type. So a pointer in C is a variable that holds a memory address. This memory address is the address of another variable, mostly uh, of same data type. And uh, in simple words, if one variable stores the address of second variable, then the first variable can be said to point towards the second variable. So before we start understanding uh, what pointer uh, and what they can do, let's start by understanding what does address of memory location means. So what is memory address in C? Whenever a variable is defined in C, a memory location is assigned for it in which its value gets stored. We can check this memory address using the AND symbol. So if uh, where is the name of the variable, then address of where uh, will give its address. Then uh, write a small program. For example, uh, hash include stdio.h, it is the header file. That is hash include, uh, it is a preprocessor and hash uh, standard input output header file. Then uh, void main and here we uh, uh, given a integer type of variable that is var equals to uh, then enter some value that is 7. The value of the variable is var is 7 and then memory address of that variable that is the address of var. So, definition and declaration of pointers. A pointer declaration names a pointer variable and uh, specifies the type of the object to which the variable points. A variable declared as a pointer holds a memory address. The star symbol indicates that the variable is a pointer. To declare a variable as a pointer, you must prefix it with star. In the example, uh, above we uh, have done a pointer declaration and name um, ptr1 with the data type integer so how to declare a pointer in c so uh, syntax of that uh, of the declaration of pointer is data type stars pointer and then variable name for example int star ptr1 semicolon then then how to initialize a pointer in c there are uh, 22 ways of initializing the pointer in C. Once the pointer declaration is done, look at the example before uh, below to understand. For example, int a is equal to 5. Then int star ptr1 is equal to address of a. This is the method 1. And then integer star ptr2 is equal to ptr1. This is the method second. So int a is equal to 5 int star ptr1 address of a declaration and initializing the pointer then print ptr1 print the memory address that points to the point uh, pointer points to then next is the star print uh, percent d star ptr1 prints the value uh, the pointer points to then address operator the unary address of operator is ampers and return the address of that is a pointer to its operand and the operand of the address of operator can be function uh, designator 
or an uh, i value that refers uh, to an object that not a bit field so pointer variable uh, is the is that shows the memory address of another variable as its value a pointer variable points to a data type like in of the same data uh, same type and is created with the star operator this is example of that uh, pointer Thank you.